Hello, hello friends, Dapper Driver here, and welcome to another deck profile of the Alolan Raichu deck here. Um, I like this deck a lot. Feel free to copy it, make it your own, and um, let me know what works for you. So, of course we have Raichu in here, but in order to get an Alolan Raichu, you gotta have a Pikachu. So, we have four Pikachus, they are all the same. Three are from the pink collection, but we were able to get the other one, I believe, out of the uh, McDonald's. There's McDonald's promo 5 out of 12. It's a pretty good condition. And I like the artwork on it. So here we go. We got three, four, actually four Pikachus with the 70 HP so that they can't be sniped from like Greninjas and stuff. So that is awesome. So we'll go ahead and sit that there. We got three Alolan Raichus, the star of this deck. But uh, unfortunately in the playthrough, it just did not, did not run very well. So, Raichu has Surge Surfer. If there's a stadium in place, Pokemon has Free Retreat, which you can't scoff at. Free Retreat's always a good thing. On uh, Psychic, this attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. So it's the same attack as a Ranguru, but um, has 10 less HP and does 10 more damage with Psychic. So, very interesting. Uh, that 10 damage can matter sometimes. We're going to uh, round it out with Raichu GX as a backup attacker. Raichu GX is good for that powerful spark, similar to Darkrai's uh, Dark Pulse, I believe. And then Thunder does 160 damage, Voltail does 120 and paralyzes your opponent. This is all pretty, pretty good stuff. And uh, I think most people are considering this the Alolan Raichu GX due to the fact that it came out in Shining Legends. So the best of both Raichus right there in one deck. We have a Ranguru. For some general draw support, Instruct is just too good. You, if you have Fall but under three cards, you can continue drawing with an Orangaroo. Um, we also have two Raikus, a great backup attacker, and also a good stall machine. We can end up putting him on the front lines with the, uh, with the Lightning Energy and the Aether Paradise Conservation Area up, and he takes 50 less damage per turn, which is awesome. And then we have two Voltorbs, um, mostly just to evolve into two electrodes. Electrodes have that buzz zap thunder. You blow it up, you get two lightning energies out of it. You can attach to Raikou, Raichu GX, Alolan Raichu, um, anything that's a lightning type uh, electrode can't attach itself to. And then to finish off the Pokemon part of this list, we have two Tapu Leles for that general draw support and search. You want to search for your Bridget's and get those uh, Pokemon out ASAP so you can evolve them. Um, search for Sycamore. We don't play a heavy supporter line, so the ability to search out the exact one we need at any given moment is a good thing. So, for items, we have a counter catcher because we plan on being below on prize cards uh, due to the electrode, so we can use counter catcher to pull out something that our opponent does not want out. We have a field blower. Um, we're not super uh ability reliant but field blower is always a good thing to take out those pesky tools that are in our way we have four max elixir this is what makes it turbo right here there's four max elixir mixed with electrode mixed with counter energy makes this a very turbo deck i just got to figure out the exact numbers that work the best so we have four max elixirs so that we can get those energies onto the basics we play 11 energies in total i believe so we have a special charge to get back those counter energies we have two Super Rods to get back those basic energies and our Pokemon. Could play one Brock's Grit and save a space, but uh, Super Rod is good because you can play a supporter the same turn. And then it's just pretty standard, a four count of Ultra Ball there so that we can discard two cards and pick out whatever Pokemon we want. So for stadiums, we play one stadium. We play three copies of that one stadium. Aether, Paradise, Conservation Area, Basic, Grass, and Lightning Pokemon. Take 30 less damage from your opponent's attack after applying weakness and resistance. So we got three of these guys to be able to uh, help that Raikou just be uh, a tank. A tank that can take hits and just take hits and take hits and take hits. So on to the supporters. We're playing two Bridget's, pretty standard in most things. We can search them out with Tapu Lele turn one in order to uh, grab anything we want. We're playing two Guzmas. Uh, just so we can pull something off the bench that we want to knock out with uh, if we have the right numbers for something on the bench But we don't have it for the active we can switch things out with Guzma and take out the benched Mon We play one Luzamine to pull some stuff back out of the discard pile Two in any combination supporter stadium cards from your discard pile to your hand 
This is great for reusing your Guzmas late game. Great for, you know, using a second Bridget if you end up finding your stuff knocked down. Um, we play three in, pretty standard. And that's also why we play three in, because we have a Luzamine to pull it back up. We play three Sycamores, which is also pretty standard. Again, Luzamine, we can pull them back up. Um, we're playing three Choice Bands. Um, so those extra numbers against everything. And we're playing two Counter Energies. I wish I was playing four. But two is all I could find in my uh, in my collection. So I gotta find where I've left the other ones or what happened to them. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten lighting energy to finish off the deck so that Max Elixir can work. Um, more would not be a bad idea, but this deck space is super tight, tight, tight knit. So if you guys have something you can remove to add extra energy. By all means, do it. Um, I think my normal count is, you know, on the deck I really like to play online is, you know, four is ten, ten lightning, four counter, which means I think we did not have counter catcher, and we did not have uh, we didn't have a fourth max elixir, so we were able to fit in the two counter energies that way, but. Thank you guys so much for coming out. This has been the Raichu, the Alolan Raichu deck um, to finish out the year. Let me know what you guys think, how you guys play it that's different, what do you think I did wrong, all that jazz. Uh, and this is also going to be the last video I record for the year. So thank you guys so much for a wonderful year. We got some, we got up pretty high on um, some stuff considering I don't really ask for subscribers, I don't really ask for likes. And you guys have been coming out and do again anyway. So thank you guys so much for that. Um, but for now, I'm going to go enjoy time with my family. I want to bid you guys a Lola. I hope you enjoy time with yours. And I hope to see you on the next video in the new year. Bye-bye.